Lisa. Look at you. Have a seat. Oh. So um, I'm Eddie Adams, and I have a problem with my style. I love this. So I've been doing drag for about 12 years now. Okay. Excellent. I've spent so long becoming the best woman that I can possibly be that I've completely forgotten how to be a man. Awesome. What? what? <laughs> so you want to go back to... Back to basics. Before all the wow. sort of drag and everything. Yeah, I'm really interested in giving it a go. I'm, I'm fascinated. <laughs> you haven't said a word. I'm sitting I'm gobsmacked. Oh. I've got your tongue. Well, Dan's a little I, confused about how he feels at the moment. I don't know. Really. It happens all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Eddie Adams, I'm from Brighton, and I'm a drag queen. Hustling, hustling, hustling. I've been dressing in drag for about 12 years, really, just over now. Hustling, hustling, hustling. Being dressed as a woman is, is my life, this is what I do. But I think because I look just so damn good as a woman, I really have lost confidence in the, the way I look dressed as a man. The most blokey thing I've ever done was actually recently when I went into the men's bathroom and used a urinal. I don't have any idea where to start when it comes to trying to be one of the lads or act like a boy. I'm nearly 30. This is really my last chance to see if I can make it as a man in this world. You are just a drag queen. I, yeah, absolutely, okay. just a drag queen. I'm not a transsexual. People get confused and think that I'm trying to be a woman when that's not actually the case. I'm absolutely 100% a man. So how often would you say you put, you know, your drag... How, how often are you doing this? Usually, I mean, it's unusual for me to be dressed like this in the daytime. There's nothing worse than uh, daylight drag. Um, <laughs> uh, you know, it's anywhere from uh, two nights a week to five nights a week. Obviously, you're more confident when you're in drag, obviously, than you are when you're... Of course. The guy. Yeah. Certainly don't feel attractive. No eyebrows on and uh, looking like a man. So, like, let's say when you come out of drag, let's say you go into the shops, 